guys, welcome to another episode of Rad Dad Toolbox. Today we are going to be opening a brand new pair of the Ray-Ban Story, Wayfarer Stories. These are unbelievably cool and we'll go ahead and get started here. Boom. Just got my box in the mail here. So let's see what we got in here. And I'm gonna do this uh, one-handed and I'll put it on a tripod here in a minute. Uh, the cool thing with this, the new way to capture, share, and listen. So these are the latest and greatest Ray-Ban Wayfarer stories. And what these do is they're basically a pair of sunglasses that you can listen to your music on. Um, you can uh, record video with two 5-megapixel cameras. Super, super cool. Let's keep opening this up. All right, let's get this opened up. The Wayfair Ray-Ban Stories. Man, that's kind of a significant box there for a pair of glasses. Uh, compatible with iPhone, made for iPhone, sweet. Um, man, and I got these off of a Facebook ad. So let's see what it looks like in here. All right, it looks like we pull this. And it's got a little uh, tab here that says Ray-Ban, so I don't know if we pull that and the whole thing slides. I'm being challenged here as I open this box. It's very tight, very significant, very uh, heavy, like I say, for a pair of sunglasses. Oh, it looks like there's a tab on this side. So Ray-Ban, Stories, Wayfarer. These are black. Oh yeah, look at this. Wow, quite the box. We're going to lift that up. Hallelujah. I'm going to pull that out. Looks like we've got the glasses. I'll open here in a second. It says download the Facebook View app. So we'll do that here in a second. Looks like we've got some kind of a charge cable, I assume. Let's see what that is. We'll slide that out. Definitely a charge cable, it looks like. So, yeah, with the... Uh... Oh, it's got the... Um... C type, USB-C, and then it's got a, uh, looks like a normal USB there. Actually, no, it's C to C. Bing, bing, it's a C to C cable for uh, charging and data, etc. Let's see what this says. It says download the Facebook View app. So let's see what that is. There's something in here besides download the Facebook View app. Oh, okay. Super good packaging, really, really cool. So we've got a reference guide. We've got a safety and warranty, and we've got a um, carrying case, it looks like, for the glasses, which is nice, very soft. Keep them in good shape. So now, let's open the glasses. Hallelujah. Wow, look at those. Really, really nice packaging here. It looks like there's a... I'll set those down for a second. It looks like there's a charge port maybe right in the in the uh, cover that allows them to charge and be protected, which is a really cool idea. And uh, let's see, we've got the protective uh, styrofoam here, so we'll pull that off. Wow, those look great. Um, and then I believe it has, looks like there's a little speaker there. Um, yeah, interesting. I wonder how you listen to it as well. But here's the cool part. Look at this. It actually has five, two 5 megapixel video cameras that you can use there. So you can take video while you're driving, which is really cool. Let's see how they look. Yes, very cool. Um, dark. They actually are a lot more svelte than I would think. They're slimmer than you would think. They actually fit your head a little slimmer than you think. Uh, but yeah, I think they look pretty good. So I think they're going to function really great as sunglasses. And uh, yeah, we'll start uh, getting them set up here. Okay, it says to download the Facebook View app. So I'm going to see if I can find that on the App Store and download that now. Okay, just read uh, the app and I'll show some pictures of that app so you know you're on the right one. And it kind of walks you through a setup. So it says to slide this power switch until you see a white LED blinking so you slide oh there it is 
I think it was blinking there on the bottom. I think I saw it blinking on the bottom. Let's make sure. I saw it just a second ago here. Okay, so I think we got that going. Okay, it says to charge them if the white LED doesn't stay on, so it looks like we're gonna to need to charge these, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Um, it goes in the case to charge them, so I'm gonna pull those up for right now, and then it says to remove this little plastic thing over the charge tab right there, and then let's see how we put them in the case for charging. I, oh, I see, ah! See that little, the little contacts there? Those rest right on there. Oh, and it's magnetic, sweet, super cool. So it's magnetic where it charges. And then we will go ahead and plug this in and charge it fully. I'll look in the manual to see how long that takes and I'll be right back. All right, so there's a little uh, USB-C port right here and I'm going to use my handy dandy, very hammered MacBook Pro uh, cord because it's a C as well, but it's got a lot longer cord and uh, we'll go ahead and plug that in and then uh, once it's charged We're coming back at you. Actually before it's charged. I'm just gonna show you here It doesn't look like there's any indicator lights or anything when it charges So I'm gonna check in the manual to see how long we need to charge it All right, so I just checked and it says actually dock it for 15 to 30 minutes and charge it and this is a Sorry for my cluster down here bigger charger with higher watts. So I'm guessing 15 to uh, 30 minutes. There is a small indicator light now that I'm seeing that shows that it's charging right here. It's a very small little LED that blinks. So uh, we'll go ahead and charge it and we'll be right back with you. Oh, actually while we're waiting, we're gonna go through the reference guide. So you can see here, let's see where everything is. So A is the power switch. That's what we just slid and it showed briefly the white light, but uh, didn't stay on. So it says to go ahead and charge it, which is what we're doing right now. Looks like there's a button on the right side as you're wearing them, the B button, that's for capture. C is your camera, so there's two cameras, one here, one there. Uh, D is a touchpad, oh, super cool. So it's got a little touchpad on the side. E is the capture LED, so that's why you've got the camera going, you'll know that it is capturing or running. F is speakers, so the speakers are back by your ears. That'll be interesting to see how good those speakers are. Uh, G, let's see what G is. G is the, oh, right there, the microphone. So it's right by the Ray-Ban emblem, uh, maybe on the front or on the back side. And H is a notification LED. Let's see where that is. Uh, I'm probably looking right at it and I don't see it. Uh, oh, there's H. So H is a notification LED uh, right there. Sorry for my breaking news. I don't know if you can see that. All right, and then there's the icon. When you go to your app store, that's what it looks like. That's the Facebook View app that you need to download right away. Slide to the right and release to turn on, which we tried to do. Slide to the left to turn off. Well, that makes a lot of sense. And let's see if there's anything else on the back. Oh, all in... Uh, French, etc. on the back, it looks like. So, pretty good little quick reference uh, guide. Um, looks good. So, we're going to keep charging that and hopefully uh, show you how these things work here in just a minute. I'm just reading the box while I'm using my time so wisely here. Interesting, it says for ages 13 and up, so they don't want kids playing with this thing. It says Ray-Ban Stories features dual cameras, which we talked about, open-ear audio, and pairs with the Facebook View app to edit and share your content. So this is super cool because I'm obviously a YouTuber. I ride Harleys, I ride motorcycles, four-wheelers, uh, fun cars, etc. So I'm looking forward to seeing how good it captures as we uh, go to use these. One other thing I can appreciate about these Ray-Ban Wayfarer stories is that, uh, and this is the modern way with Amazon, et cetera, but uh, it says, first of all, the new way to capture, share, and listen, which is what we're all about today. We're gonna show you how those work and give you some kind of a review on them. But I love the fact that they have a shipping label. They have a really nice shipping box. They have a cover to put your uh, glasses in, and then they have specific instructions here at the bottom 
uh, on how to return it. So if in the event, and let's hope we don't have that, but in the event you need to return them, they've made it very simple to uh, get them back and probably either get a new repair or get a refund, etc. So pretty, pretty thoughtful, excellent packaging. All right, so I've gone 25 minutes. It's still blinking, so I assume it's still charging. It didn't really give me a place where it would say, does it turn green or solid or disappear when it quits charging? So I'm gonna let it go for a little while longer here. We'll be back with you. So the answer is yes, when it turns green, it is charged. So let's go about uh, getting this set up now. Okay, so we'll go ahead and turn it on. So, okay, on the right side of the lashes, you can see a little white LED blinking, which means they are charged now and ready to work. Okay, it's hard to see with my overhead lights. Sorry, they're so bright, but that little LED has turned green, which means you're ready to proceed. Okay, then you slide the power switch again, which is on that side, forward until this blue is blinking and of course then it's in pairing mode. So let's see what we do next. Hi guys, I'm using the voice assistant to Facebook to capture this video right now. Hopefully the sound is good. We'll see. Okay, we're gonna go check this out. I'm gonna walk out of my upstairs office. We've been playing with video and so far so good. We're gonna go out here and take a picture of the mountains. This is my Honda Monkey, kind of a throwback bike. Grew up on a little Honda Mini Trail 70. I'll be doing a uh, review on this in the not too distant future. But I want to see how these glasses do with background sound. So I'm going to go ahead and ride it up and down my lane here. Okay, I'm going to see how this does with background noise on my little motorcycle here going down my lane. I want to see how good that looks, the water flowing and the sound of it. I want to see if you, how well you can hear that water in our fountain here. And then we're going to walk down this lane just to get a feel for that. Pretty dang cool. Let's see how clear those leaves are when we look at the playback. Look how beautiful it is out here today, testing these glasses out. There's my truck. All shiny. I want to see how good it picks up those shiny, uh, the color there. And then look at the colors up in the mountains. Absolutely gorgeous. So far, I'm really impressed with this camera. Hey guys, thanks for joining us today on the channel. Man, these Ray-Ban Wayfarer stories, great video, great sound. And man, they don't look too bad either. I think they look pretty cool. But uh, thanks for joining today. And can you learn how to use these? absolutely you can please subscribe please pound that like button until next time